Welcome back, heroes, to some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. Last episode, we defeated Merrick and won the Battle City Tournament. However, our Egyptian God cards then got stolen by Dart and his crew. The Seal of Ori Calcos is now in play, and we are going to finish off the uh, the whole Yu-Gi-Oh! first season with three last duels. A duel against Raphael, where Yu-Gi loses. A duel against Dart, and then the Pharaoh versus Yu-Gi, which is going to be one hell of a duel. Alright, grappling with the Guardian. Okay, so Yugi and his friends found Joey, but it was too late. Joey's soul had been taken by the Orichalcos. What's going on here? Don't you see? Joey must have defeated Valon, and then Mai showed up. She did this to him, I'm sure of it. That's true. However, there's only one person we can really blame for all of this. I think you know who I mean. He hides safely in his fortress while others do his dirty work. Well, not anymore. Yugi arrived at Darta's fortress, uh, Paradeus headquarters, and found an unconscious Mai. Mai, say something. She must have been in a duel, and it appears she lost. Both the duel and her soul. Must put an end to this. It's about time you showed up. This doesn't concern you, Raphael. I'm here to see darts. Is your master so much of a coward that he sent you to do his battles for him? Not quite, but first, why don't you take this? It's the Claw of Hermos, Joey's card. Sure, the one who defeated Joey, aren't you? Actually, Mai beat Joey. Then I defeated her. But why? Wasn't Mai on your side? I never trusted her, and it turns out I was right all along. After she took Joey's soul, she turned on us. Biggest mistake she ever made. Wait, I think at this point in the story, Yugi already lost to Raphael. I think this is like the second time they duel. Wake up, can't you see that your so-called master Dart is just using you to satisfy his own selfish needs? If you really need to save the world and stop fighting me and join my side. As soon as the great beast is revived, I'm afraid your side will no longer exist, Pharaoh. All it needs to get started is one more strong soul. And the sacred seal of Orichalcos will take care of that once I take you down. The winner leaves a free man. The loser becomes a prisoner to the beast. You're on. That's what it takes to set my friends free? Then let's duel. And once you're out of my way, I can go straight for darts. Okay, so we're not gonna go use the, um, we'll go for the duel where Yugi just uses Capult Turtle to sacrifice everything just to do some damage, then end up losing. Right, let's go for scissors. Hey, and we are going to go second. I have no idea what this dude's deck is. I cannot remember. I just remember his cards are like super old, super worn out. And oh, okay, not bad hand. I think got the seal to start things off with. Great. Okay. We got. Uh, let's see, let's see. It's gonna set you. Gonna set this. Gonna set this. And then I end my turn. Gonna hold on the graceful charity just for another turn, just to see what we can kind of do. All right, father that's fine. Okay, one thousand five hundred. Oh, okay. That's fine. Take that one thousand two hundred damage, boy. Or oh, eight hundred damage. So I thought we had 3,000 uh, defense. <laughs> oh, dude, can you imagine? Got another one, okay. Uh, Crystal Charity, got to activate this now. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Another one, I guess. That's like Necro Gardener, isn't it? So we're let's get rid of that. Let's tribute Big Shield Gardener for Dump Shun Girl. I don't think I want to activate the Claw of Hermos just yet.
Do I? Which ones do we have? We just have the bow. Yeah. And that. Negate the first effect activated by your opponent during each battle phase. I think I'd rather wait, because if we get an eye to mice, we can get Dark and Girl or Dragon Knight, which would be sick, because every turn, just bam, drop a card, pop a monster, or face up. Uh, let's... Let's just battle phase it. To be 500. Okay. And end our turn. Domination in the graveyard as well. That extra damage is nice. Oh, okay. Can't do anything. Oh, let's go. Can we win? I think we can win. So that's four. Uh, sorry, it's um, 3,900. 5,900. Just a little bit off. Right? Is my, if, no, is my math fine? So that'd be. 4,800, 5,800. Yeah, just a little, a little bit short. Is it worth it? I take 4,000. Oh, it's from your deck, not your hand. Oh, dude, I can't activate this. That means this is a dead card. That's annoying. Oh, I've done Magic Curtain was like deck or hand. That'd be so good. It's actually kind of annoying. That's not me how bad that card is. For like paying half your life point. I guess the lower your life points are the better, but that's actually kind of annoying, dude. Or at least like graveyard and deck, not just deck. Huh. Swords, okay. That's fine. I have an MST. <laughs> we win! Yeah! Oh, drew another MST, so... Just activate that one. <laughs> See ya! Swords revealing light. Well, this works out well for us. That's quite an easy, uh... Easy duel. Assume we got lucky with him not going to get anything off, though. We didn't take any damage. So, darts fed you lies. In the moment of weakness, you allowed your heart, uh, heart your heart be consumed by the dark magic of the Oracalcos. But I could tell that the real you was still in there, fighting to break free. I knew what I had to do, force you to face the darkness. You're right, thank you. I get it now. Everyone I turn my back on is still here, and they always will be with me. Hey, the seal has gone. Where'd it go? Doesn't it usually put on a big green laser show? Yeah. And it usually takes someone's soul too. So how are you still here? I'm lost. I have a theory. The seal of Orichalcos is powered by the darkness from the person who plays it. But Raphael was able to conquer that darkness. So my soul was spared. I'm free. Hey. You got lucky, dude. Alright, now a duel with darts. After defeating Raphael, Yugi finally met darks face to face. Darts! You're expecting someone else? Well, due to the callousness of my employees, I'm the only one left. You can't find good help these days. Look, I want my company back. So, count the small talk. Is that so? Well, guess what? We all want something. As for me, I want your souls. For the last time, release our friends. That's not possible. What do you mean? I mean, they've already been put to use. As we speak, their life energy supplies power to the most devastating creature that ever lived. Oh, great. Now what? My 10,000 year old collection is almost complete. Once it gets yours, my beast can rise. Hold on, you've been collecting souls for all those years? Do you know how many lives you've destroyed? <laughs> Millions! So, some of these people lived in the past. Now you're catching on. Ever since the Great Leviathan was laid to rest, I've been gathering the energy necessary to fuel its rebirth. Come on, you expect us to believe that junk? Ye of little faith. Just do me and I promise I'll make a believer out of you. For when you lose, there'll be no denying my power. 
I like how Kaiba always denies like all this like, you know, voodoo stuff till the very end. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go for rock. No, oh, sucks. <laughs> Again, darts, I don't remember his deck at all. I just remember the, the, the infinite monster dude and I don't remember what Yuki uses. So it's still gonna be the Tamiya stuff. Right. Seven colored fish, okay. Mage power, oh great. Okay, great. 2,800, seven colored fish. Excellent. Um, all right, aggressive charity. Woo, okay. All right, so send one trap card from your hand or fill up the grave that is listed on a fusion material monster that can be special summoned. Isn't it Mirror Force? I think it might be, so let's get rid of that. Get rid of Dark Magician Girl. Yeah, Mirror Force Dragon, okay. Right. Activate this. Yeah, boy, let's go. Cannot remember its effect, but I'm sure we'll find out in a second. Uh, so, when a monster you control is targeted for an attack by an opponent's card effect, except during the damage that you control. Okay. Another graceful charity. And the magnet warriors that rock. Third graceful charity. Oh snap! Or oh, oh dude, that sucks. All right, go get relaxed in the graveyard. Um, I wanna. I'm gonna get rid of Thax. I'm sure we'll draw another one. Okay. Maybe one per turn. <laughs> Fair enough. Right, uh. Oh, we could. Next turn, we can go in. Yeah, don't want to attack. Oh, I might, I might have to sacrifice, because. He can just get stronger, like, I have to get rid of this now. I think I do anyway. I'm just gonna go for it, I have to get rid of him. Oh, thanks. He has that big dude, which is not great at the moment. Uh, set this. I think that was the right play, because all he had to do is set one more card, and that seven colored fish can destroy my Mirror Force Dragon. Okay, that's good. Take that damage. All right, we about to go in. Big mistake putting them in attack mode, that's all I'm saying. Right, so if we go tribute. And I right, Tamias. Uh, can you activate one? Oh, is that the whole like new rolling thing? I think you can't get more than like one special at a time, right? Unless you use a link. Is that how it works? Because that's one thing like I never like understood. Like I never look, really looked into with the new rules of Yu-Gi-Oh. Like you can't just. Pretty sure you can't. Because obviously when I. Started um, when I stopped playing, 
the fusion extra zone wasn't here, so I'm assuming you can't just flood the field with fusions anymore, which is um, kind of annoying. But, you know, it's whatever. Can this be destroyed with battle? Can we destroy by card effects? Oh, when I activate it now, so I'm going to have to destroy this. It's kind of annoying, but... Ooh, but is it on the field as well? Yeah, so I'm going to do main phase 2 set this just in case. Just in case. Alright. I should really look up, like, I was going to look up how the li whole Link stuff works before I got to, like, um, v Rain's arc in this game. I'm after that sooner rather than later. Oh, you suck. That's annoying. <laughs> that is really annoying. Guess I'll go for this then. Man, darts, you suck. I hate you. <laughs> Alright, at least he's got like, no cards in hand. I doubt whatever this is, it'll be able to stop it unless the face down can do it. Good. Alright, let's go. I really hope this just goes our way. Come on, nothing. Okay, good. Oh, obnoxious Celtic Guardian, dude. I remember this. <laughs> right. Uh, let's go. Battle phase. Get you to attack. Okay, and 1 4. And then we end our turn. Dude, we are so winning this. Never claw hurts, okay. <laughs> Come on, nothing to stop me. Hey! Next turn, boys. Oh no, D prison! You suck! Wait, uh when the monster you can try to type by effect, punch card effect. Sure, all cards, okay. I thought it was all monsters, but all cards are still good. Thanks. Oh, seriously, I'll jump that trio. Uh, okay, um... I guess that's fine. That's fine. If we can just draw one monster. One level four monster, like a Queen's Knight or something. A, a, uh, oh, wait. Can we activate this? Wait, hell. It's too late now. Uh, that's Legend of Heart. Alright, we want to get... This is going to make it attack twice. And we can start get rid of him, yeah. Do 2 8. Okay. Do 2800. The next turn, if you don't draw a monster, we good. We can't even, like, destroy by battle. This is more than 1900, which is still doable, but. 800 life points, come on, we got this. And... We win! Unless that's like, another deep prison or something, but... From the look of it, we win. So, 
So let's just win. Hey, we won. Feed darts. You lose darts. Your ten thousand year quest is finally over. It can't be. I've come too close. All I need is one more powerful soul, and the great Leviathan will arise from the depths of the earth. Too little, too late. Our duel comes to an end. Now release the souls of my friends and everyone else you held captive. Darts failed to capture Yami Yugi's soul, but Darts merged his own soul with his Leviathan to revive the beast instead. Powered by the light of his friends, Yugi retrieved his stolen Egyptian god cards, defeated Darts and his Leviathan once and for all. Hey look, I guess the gods did pull through. Told ya! That means everyone Darts captured is free. Is it really over? Yep, we're safe now. Let's hit the high road, folks. I'm sure there's someone else trying to take over the world back home. You know, the scary thing is, he's probably right. <laughs> hey, I think it's Bakora next, right? Well, try to take over the world. I think he's the one that sent him to the past, I think? I can't really remember. But anyway, the final duel. So, now that the Pharaoh saved the world, there's one last thing to do, or he had to do. Move on to the afterlife. Guided by Marek, Shizu, and Odeon, the team went to a secret underground temple that housed the gateway to the afterlife to open the door. The pharaoh had to seal away the Egyptian god cards and the seven millennium items and have one final duel, a ritual duel against Yugi. The duel would determine whether Yugi could now stand on his own as his own man and not need the pharaoh's help anymore. This is the first time in my life that I've hoped my opponent for my opponent's victory, but in order for this duel to truly test our readiness to separate, I must fight with all of my strength. Pharaoh, now that you've left the Millennium Puzzle, I can't hear your thoughts anymore, but somehow, I still know what you're thinking, and I feel the same way. If you taught me anything, it's to put your heart into your deck and duel with everything you've got. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Hey, I'm ready. Here we go, boys. Uh, let's go rock. I'm going second. I remember this, though. I think doesn't the Pharaoh get out all three Egyptian god cards at some point. Can't remember how little Yugi beats him though. Alright, okay. Pot of greed, Grace or Charity. <laughs> oh man. Oh okay, just going straight for the 4,000 life points. Secret Arts. Man, that's a blast from the past. Right, so... I have not used these, like, um... The level monsters in such a long time. So each time your opponent draws a card, place one spell card on this card, max 500, gains 500 attack for each spell card. During the step next standby phase of your next turn, off the fifth spell count is placed on this card, you can send this card with face-up card with five spell counts on it to special... Or to the graveyard, special one... Uh, Silent Magician level 8 from your deck. What does level up do? Send one face up level monster. You control the graveyard special one monster from your deck or hand that's listed in the sent monster's tech. Click on summon. Okay, so we can get level 8 right away. It says deck though. I'm assuming we, we must have more than one copy in the deck. Otherwise, that's just a very, very bricky hand. So, let's just try it. Good. Oh, wait, wait, this is a hand as well? Oh yeah, okay, hand or deck. I just, I just saw deck, man. My mind went blank. That's not good. Anyway, uh, let's set this. Get that ready. And then let's go for battle phase. Get wrecked, boy. Alright. Uh, okay, uh, can't be this. Unaffected by your opponent's spell cards. Okay. And this is just like another monster. Defense position as effect monster. This card is also a trap card. While you control red, green, and yellow gadget, this card gains 3,000 attack. Oh, okay. Man, I missed the gadgets. <laughs> right, let's just knock with this just yet. Yeah. That's the reincarnation. Against the King's Knight. Okay. Mm 
I think we got this door in the bag. Uh... Right, so if we do this... I'm not sure if this counts as one? Yeah, can do it. It's a bit worried for a second then. And then level up. I say, what's off after level eight? <laughs> Don't remember anything after level eight. Right, let's go, boys. I think we win. Oh, dude, we just... We just won. <laughs> that was too easy, man. I feel like I should just go do the duel again, because that was just so... So easy. Congratulations, well done. Yugi, you achieved a great victory for us both. That was just, just so anticlimactic compared to the actual duel of the anime. I was focusing so hard on playing the game that I forgot what winning this duel would actually mean. But defeating you... I've sent you away for good. No, you've opened the door for me. Thanks to you, my spirit can finally be at rest once again. I'll be where I belong. Fate brought the two of us together for a reason. And we've fulfilled our destiny. We've protected mankind from the return of the Shadow Games. We've both grown tremendously along the way. I'm gonna miss you. You do realise we'll never truly be apart, right? The gift of kindness you've given me and the courage I've given you remain with us. And that will forever bind us together. Right. Now that the battle ritual is complete, the Eye of Wujia that guards the door to the spirit world has awakened. The spirit of the Great Pharaoh, which is which was trapped within the Millennium Puzzle for 5,000 years, is now free. The time has arrived. Tell the Eye of Wujia your name. I am son of the King uh, Aknam Kanan. My name is Atem. Hey. And there we go. We have finished. The, uh, the original series of Yu-Gi-Oh! I mean, you can do the reverse doors, but... Maybe I'll save that for like a stream or something, so I, I kind of want to stream this game as well. I mean, for this series though, we're just going to go play through the main campaigns. But next, we'll be doing Yu-Gi-Oh! GX! Which, dude, I remember a lot about, but... Also forgot quite a bit. Like, I think I more or less remember... The beginning and the end. The middle is just a bit lost on me, but there's a lot of duels. But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and next episode we start Yu Gi Oh! GX. Peace.